we started looking for a second home, we, we really started looking in southwest Michigan. We kind of, we have some friends that are up there on, on Lake Pawpaw and, and some relatives and you know, we kind of got the bug. Brenda's going to be retiring in another year. And so uh, we went up there, you know, looked around. It was a little pricey and it's, you know, it's a two hour drive. Um, so we, believe it or not, we've seen a, an ad in the newspaper about Heritage Harbor and came down and, and visited. Uh, and then we have some very good friends that have friends that had bought down here. They uh, kind of showed us around, told us their story, and we became believers. Before when we were looking for something was uh, access to water. We thought in the future we'd get maybe a pontoon boat, something to do while we were at the place. And then we found out connected to this was the Quest program. So we joined the Quest program, which is perfect for us because we're, we're not handy people to maintain a boat and they do that for you and um, so it, it all worked out so another thing we were looking for to have there was activities to do recreation things we like to be outside and that's what we found all in one here for individuals like us who uh, don't want to have a, a, a boat payment insurance a maintenance a storage all of the things that are involved with owning a boat um, it's kind of the best of both worlds for us. I just make a reservation uh, right there online. I can pick out the boat that we want for the, the, the time period that's available to us. You pay a one-time fee every year for that. They meet you uh, at the boat. If you need a bag of ice, you tell them ahead of time they've got a bag of ice there for you. They get you on the boat, they get you going. 15 minutes from when we're ready to return, we just uh, send a text message that we're on our way back and they meet us back there. We don't have to worry about fueling and uh, it's, uh, it's just it's wonderful, really. We weren't boating people either, so they also <laughs> are res very responsive. So they always have somebody that if you need to call them or text them for a question, they're right there and walk you through it too. So and they're very friendly. We've never had a problem getting a boat when we wanted a boat, so it's been perfect for us. You know, we were really surprised. Uh, I knew a little bit about Ottawa before we, you know, we bought down here. But number one, they are the friendliest people I, I have ever met. Living in the suburbs of Chicago and then coming down here and having to buy a meal down here, it's like, it's like half price, you know, 50% <laughs> off. I mean, you know, the, it's uh, just a different world. Uh, we have been to many restaurants in downtown Ottawa, uh, the streets and done some shopping and there's a farmer's market on Saturdays. And, wine fest. Uh, wine fest. Um, yeah, some very, very cool things going on in Ottawa. All the time. They seem like they have something going on all the time. The favorite part of our house is the porch. Mm -hmm. uh, now that we have it screened in, we are really going to take advantage of it this year. Uh, we put in a spiral staircase so it's a little bit easier to get up and down to the loft. It's got everything you could possibly need right here as far as living for a for a week or a weekend or... It looks small from the outside, but the amount of people that um, can stay here is up to eight to probably 10 people. We can sleep two on our pullout here in the living room, two in the bedroom, the loft also has a pullout up there, as well as an air mattress can easily fit two people, so. And one of the great things that they did when they designed this place is that no matter where your cottage is located, you, everybody, even us who face the street, we have a river view. So you can go into the bedroom and you can, you know, through the bedroom windows, we've got a river view. And you can hear the water in the morning. So if yes. you just lay there and the windows are open like last night, so this morning, you just lay there and listen to the river flow, even though it's from our bedroom. And it was very peaceful. Oh, it's happening. The steps away, it's right? It's the place, yes. man. <laughs> yeah, the Red Dog. Uh, what would this place be without the Red Dog? I mean, that's another draw. Boy, when you got a bar and grill right within, you know, a few steps away from your place, uh, and it's the hangout place, you know, that's where you get to know everybody. Uh, we have met so many wonderful people that, uh, you know, just up there, you know, having a little dinner or having a couple of drinks, and uh, you get to know everybody in this uh, small, little tight community, and, and the, the Tiki, tiki bar. bar is where it goes down in the summer. Yep, a lot of times. Entertainment at the Tiki Bar, right. drinks at the Tiki Bar. They also have a porch um, river view to eat or drink at also. Um, and again, they have activities and performances there also. It's surprising when we tell people that it's in Ottawa. They're like, Ottawa? You're kidding me. There's nothing in Ottawa. Right, <laughs> but it's, it is, it's remarkable. And 
and we love it. Mm -hmm. It is by far one of the best decisions we've ever made. Very happy. Very, very happy.